Have you ever wondered how easy it would be to buy or sell an exchange-traded fund or ETF at any given moment? This is where the concept of ETF liquidity and trading volume comes into play. ETF liquidity refers to the ability to quickly buy or sell an ETF without causing a significant price movement. It's an important measure of the efficiency and stability of the ETF market. On the other hand, trading volume is the number of shares or contracts traded in a security or market during a given period. It's an indicator of market activity and liquidity. Now imagine you're at a bustling fruit market. The most popular fruits, say apples, have the highest liquidity. They are bought and sold frequently, and their prices remain relatively stable. Less popular fruits, like dragon fruits, might have less liquidity. They're bought and sold less frequently, and their prices might fluctuate more. In this analogy, the popularity of the fruit is akin to the trading volume of an ETF, and the stability of the fruit's price is akin to the liquidity of the ETF. In the world of finance, high trading volume often leads to high liquidity. This means there are more buyers and sellers, so it's easier to buy and sell the ETF without causing a significant price movement. Conversely, low trading volume might indicate low liquidity, meaning there are fewer buyers and sellers, and buying or selling the ETF might cause a significant price movement. However, it's important not to confuse liquidity with trading volume. They are related, but they're not the same thing. An ETF might have a high trading volume but low liquidity if there are many trades but large price fluctuations. Similarly, an ETF might have low trading volume but high liquidity if there are few trades but small price fluctuations. So why does this matter? Well, understanding ETF liquidity and trading volume can help you make informed investment decisions. High liquidity generally means you can buy or sell the ETF easily, while low liquidity might mean you have to wait or might not get the price you want. Similarly, High trading volume can indicate a lively market, while low trading volume might indicate a less active market. In summary, ETF liquidity is a measure of how easily you can buy or sell an ETF without causing a significant price movement, while trading volume is a measure of how many trades are being made. They are related, but not the same thing. Understanding these concepts can help you navigate the bustling fruit market of ETF investing. So, the next time you ponder over an investment decision, remember to consider the liquidity and trading volume of the ETF.